that sounds all well and good. That's a great start. Yeah. And he started to advertise it. And what, again, depending on the source you go into, he this is where the snake oil salesman accusation a little bit comes into play. There's about eight to ten things he said this could potentially solve, from nerve trouble to a tummy ache to mental and physical exhaustion, which I guess makes sense. If you just give someone a <laughs> bottle of cocaine, they're going to probably not be exhausted anymore. No. Nope. Uh, headaches. Headaches, nausea. Impotence. Impotence, uh, apparently. So, I mean, short of claiming that this was going to restore sight to the blind and the deaf would hear again. <laughs> yeah. This was the miracle tonic everybody would have been waiting for. There weren't really stringent guidelines around how you marketed things back then. 